So, Guillermo, you should put your phone away because we're going to start a test, right? All right. Okay. Guillermo, not just out, but I need you to put it away like in your backpack. Now, Guillermo. Oh, yeah. Yeah, hurry. Let's, let's start on that test. Put your phone away. Guillermo, why is your phone still out? I asked you nicely to put it away. Don't you want to do well on this test? You need to put your phone away, okay? okay? Guillermo, not on the chair away. I need it in your backpack away. Your pocket's okay, that's okay, but I don't want to see you touching it. I want to see you starting on the test. All right. Guillermo, I need to talk to you. Can you put your phone down? Sure, what is it? I have some bad news. You didn't do really great on the test yesterday. I think you need to go talk to Mrs. Ferry because she has a lot of expertise in phone addiction and media addiction. And I think you need to have a conversation with her about how to spend less time on your phone and more time on your schoolwork. Well, Miss Ferry, um, I've been addicted to my phone lately and and I just, I just want to get off that. I mean, do you have any tips that I could do? So phones really can be addicting. It's really good that you're wanting to get off your phone. I think the number one tip would be leave it at home. If you can leave your phone at home and come to school, you're in great shape. If you need it for some reason, keep it turned off and keep it in your backpack. Thank you, Missy Ferry, for the help. Um, I appreciate your tips and I'll make sure to use that for my daily life. Because um, uh, like I said before, um, I've been uh, too, too addicted to my phone and my parents really don't like that. So you really saved my life. Thank you.